Okay. Hello, everybody. We'll be continuing negotiations to chart a path forward uh, to fully fund the government for the next year in an omnibus and our military in the NDAA. This isn't an easy process, but it's important nonetheless for the well-being of our troops, for the preservation of our national security, for the tens of millions of Americans who look to the federal government for a wide range of basic services, Democrats and Republicans must work together to fully fund the federal government and pass an omnibus and an NDA quickly. Now, we have a lot of work ahead of us, and though there's a lot of negotiating going on around us, we're going to work doggedly until we come to an agreement. Leader McConnell and I have agreed to try and work together to make sure we get a year-long omnibus funding bill done. We hope it can be done this year, and each side is going to have to give in order to send an omnibus to the President's desk and avert a pointless, painful government shutdown. I think a good number of people on the other side of the aisle are very hopeful. And today also marks one other important milestone. We're going to confirm our 89th and 90th judicial nominees to the federal bench. We're on pace to finish this year with more judges confirmed in the first two years of either of the previous two administrations. These nominees stand out not just in number, but in groundbreaking diversity. Fifty percent of the judges we confirmed are women of color. Fifty percent. That's never happened before. I think that's more than have served in the judiciary permanent, you know, for all, all time until we got here. And I'm confident that a more d diverse bench will go a long way to cultivating our trust in our courts and our democracy. Today, because of what we Senate Democrats have done, our judiciary is more balanced, more diverse, more experienced than the one our country had two years ago. We're very proud of that. Yes. Uh, the COVID vaccines have saved lives. The military has had requirements about other vaccines for decades, and there hasn't been a problem. Uh, so um, uh, it's, it's befuddling, but we're still working on it. Stance on trying to get marijuana uh, legislation. This is something, again, that's had bipartisan support. We've been working with Republicans. Um, it's a priority for me. I'd like to get it done. We'll try to discuss the best way to get it done.